Some social media posts are claiming that a bill passed in the House would automatically register young men and women for the military draft. Here's Ariane Daytil with what we can verify about the proposed legislation. Every year, Congress passes the National Defense Authorization Act. The bill sets policy for the Department of Defense and guides the military and national security funding for the next fiscal year. The House and Senate propose their own versions of the bill. Both chambers then negotiate and pass a compromise version, which then heads to the president's desk. The bill is passed without objection. A motion to reconsider is laid on the table. On June 14th, the House approved its version of the bill, and the Senate version of the bill advanced out of committee. It will head to the Senate floor for a vote this summer. Recently, several social media posts claimed the House's version of the bill would automatically register men aged 18 to 26 for the military draft, while other people claimed the Senate's version would require women to register for the draft. Multiple Verify readers, including Gene, want to know what the National Defense Authorization Act says about the draft. So, using these sources, we're answering a few questions about the bill. First up, does the House bill include a provision that would automate selective service registration for men? Although the last draft ended over 50 years ago in 1973, a federal law known as the Military Selective Service Act still requires most males aged 18 to 26 who are citizens or residents of the United States to register with the Selective Service. Right now, almost all Selective Service registrations are completed electronically, submitted via paper registration, or completed at the U.S. Post Office. The House version of the National Defense Authorization Act would amend the Military Selective Service Act to automatically register eligible men who are U.S. citizens or permanent residents between the ages of 18 and 26 nationally, meaning young men would no longer have to take any action in order to register. The provision is not included in the proposed Senate version of the bill. So yes, the House version of the bill does propose automating selective service registration for eligible men. Next, is there a proposal to register women for the draft? This year's House version of the National Defense Authorization Act does not include any provisions that require women to register, but the Senate version does. This provision faces an uphill battle to be included in the final version of the bill, as several Republican lawmakers have expressed their disapproval. With your Verify, I'm Ariante Till.